this is a message for Ghost. Ghost, what do you think you're doing? You're just wandering around on the planet Earth or you didn't even know what the heck has happened or you may think you're alive or but you are not. But then again, spirit forms and energy, you just like to use energy for other reasons. But you want to bring yourself up so you can able to scare a lot more people and pretend it was like Halloween time. But what is wrong with you? You're not supposed to be doing that. You're supposed to be thinking about other things like, um, well, if you were upon to the great white lights after when you die, you're supposed to see a white light when you die or whatever. But what are some stances about you doing something else but more creative instead of, you know, terrifying a lot of people and clients and a lot of you know, residents around you and what do you have to haunt them for? I mean, there might be a reason why if there were a case where someone murdered you or someone trying to give you hell throughout entire life and you just want to pay them back for all the, that mess that they created you. That makes a lot of sense right there. I would do the same thing if that was ever the case. But if I was a ghost, of course, that... I would be doing a lot more to help people out and be hero type, you know, like superhero, you know, like the, from the creators of Marvel. Well, for you ghost, I mean, if there was, I mean, for boundaries, right? I mean, if you're doing it just for the hell of it, you're just wasting your time. You shouldn't even be there. I mean, that's not what. It's supposed to be about. You're supposed to be helping some other people out. Like, you know, like, example, like trying to be like a guardian angel, for example. Why are you trying to be like them by a little bit more specific ideas? Like, um, like dodge things for people and sacrifice. I mean, by living sacrifice, but not living, but in living in ghost lands, whatever. I don't know how it will inform to you, but you should be more logical what you guys do in life because there's other things you can try to do. Maybe I could um, bring company and, you know, if there was a conscience of your own living or ghost lands, I don't know what a ghost land would be like, you know, like heaven and hell between area like when um what do they call that word limbo yeah well i could done better or if i was a ghost of course i would do a lot better i'll be like similar to angels in the outfield slash the sixth man the movie the sixth man it's about a ghost who, he was a NBA star, but he passed on. And then he comes back to help his brother win basketball games. And they kept waiting after, after, and after, you know, right after another kind of way. I'll be like that if I were you. But you don't. What is wrong with you? If you want to be more like, you know, I'm here to haunt you. Come to me. I will be like a zombie. Yeah, good luck in that one. I don't understand. Why do you have to be, oh, hi, ghost. Why do you just go help someone out? Hey, there's a ghost. Hey, why do you go? Help somebody out. Help win games. Um, be like Santa wise. Replace the Santa because he does a failure job. Because um, every single year I try my best to believe in Santa Claus. I tried. Oh my God. 
just to believe. And I wrote all those things, and I was a really good guy throughout the entire years, every single year, of course. And never got a single present. And he even promised that he was going to stop by at my place. And he never did. Oh man, that really broke my heart. That broke my heart shattered. My heart shattered on a Christmas morning because Santa hasn't stopped by. And he promised in the letters that he will. I would, mm, you don't understand about that. I would fire him in that spot right there because that really um, broke my heart to death because he did an awful thing. I put my mind into him. Santa spirit, Santa style, Santa everything. I even believed in him. Oh, I tried to believe in him all oh, my gut throughout the entire year. And I was a good boy, good guy, of course, throughout the entire year, after year, after year, and never got a single present, even though he promised that he would come by to drop something for me, and he broke his promise. He'd been saying that to me every year, and he never did it. What kind of Santa is that? He, uh, he broke my heart. Literally shattered it. I could done better. I would never break. I would never break my promise. I never broke a promise in reality. But he does. He even told me that he was going to stop by in his own words. He even sent me an email or something that he was going to stop by. I'm going to stop by on your Christmas because you deserve a present. I guess I didn't deserve it that much because I haven't got nothing. See, Ghost, you should be doing something like that. You should replace the Santa Claus because he failed me so many times. And I get fed up with it, you know? He should be on the non for himself because he can't keep his promise very well. He should be uh, suspended for one year for breaking his promise. I mean, he could be doing a lot of people, he could be damaging a lot of hearts. But, I don't understand about that. But you can figure that part out really well. But do your thing, goes, but don't be stupid of what you're doing in your limbo land when you're about ready to go to heaven or hell. Or I hope you don't go to hell because it's not fun. It's not a fun place. I heard there's just nothing but lava and torture. And hell is just nothing but lava and torture. That's all you're going to experience. That's it. You're pretty much going to swim in the lava. That's what I heard. You're going to be swimming a lot in the lava land. Swimming in lava? Hmm. For the rest of your eternity. That's longer than life. That's like 999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999
as well. It's like, because he, I mean, some demons will be stabbing you while you have a really horrible sunburn. A really horrible sunburn and the demons will be stabbing you with a, like a spiker. Like a, like a, like a, what the Romans used to have before. Spears. The demons will be hitting you or hitting with the spears. With a, when while you have a a very serious bad sunburn, that's what they're saying on some in the Bible course. Oh, I'll let you go. Bye.